Oh. Hello there, my fellow British men. We are here today in the land of this dystopian society. I mean, apocalyptic society. <laughs> Where filthy immigrants have ruined this world. They we, took all the jobs and look what happened. We're here today to get rid of these filthy immigrants and return this land to its former Great British glory. Yeah. Are we ready, my fellow proud British local blokes? Oh, we are very oh, ready oh, to definitely. Go and restore Dif order to this country. Then let's go. Let's go kick out these immigrants. So, my fellow British men, just remember you need to keep your eye out for any filthy immigrants you come across. Clearly, this man was picked apart by starving immigrants. Oh, this oh to the left, to the left. You found some immigrants, Baker. Subway. Ah, Subway. Hello. There may be supplies that we can use to get rid of immigrants. We may even this... be we may even be able to buy a train that we can use to get them out of our country. A proud British subway built by proud British workers. Only the finest subways in the world. Did I ever tell you how much of a disgrace all these immigrants are to our country? I mean, come on, they come here, they take our jobs, just fuck off. <laughs> I mean, come on, never, more like, never come back here, we have managed to find supplies that the filthy immigrants haven't been able to take yet. I found some 12 gauge This is a rarity now. in this new world. 12 geared Beautiful shotgun, shotgun shells used by our British farmers in making British products for our British society. Keeping the filthy African children away from the chickens. I believe that the flooding caused in this subway was caused by the gays. Clearly, this is not part of our great British traditions. Just remember, if you want these filthy immigrants out of our country, you need to vote for you keep. And our glorious leader, Nigel Fromage. Now when we get out of this subway, we're going to go down pub and have a few pints of lager. Go smoke. Because we are just local, proud British I'm pubs. talking about subway. All these Muslims are taking over our subway and, change, and taking out all the actual meat. Placing it with this filthy halal meat. I mean, come on. Halal is a disgrace to British society. I mean, halal, more like, hello, where are all these Muslims coming from? Ah, another subway station. Let's check if we can find some British supplies. Now, this katana might look like it's Japanese, but that is only a mistake made from an untrained eye. This is actually a katana made by the great British blacksmiths. That filthy Japanese steel couldn't break a piece of wood. <laughs> It appears that a surge of filthy immigrants has come to an end. Surely this is the work of our fantastic border control. Another victory for the proud British people. Whoa! whoa, 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 whoa. That's a shrieker. Ah! Oh. Another victory for I want that you keep. We have just eliminated another filthy immigrant. The world has become a better place. Okay, I think this is the station we need to get out of, my proud British men. There's something up here. I can hear it. Sounds like a dirty immigrant trying to steal our jobs. I think the reason that there is not much food around is because all the dirty immigrants are taking them. As you can see in the chat, even the immigrants are killing each other. This is a sign that they must be eliminated by us proud British men to give them the worthy death they deserve. Where are we going? Left, okay, right? Okay, my proud it? British man, let's get out of this subway and back up to the surface. Our proud under London Whoa. underground Whoa. tube. Whoa! I didn't like the sound. What the hell it's was that? It's a flying one. Oh, dirty immigrants are flying over. Come round the other way. Filthy immigrant technology. Other side, other side. 
it would appear that the filthy immigrants have taken over the outpost. Oh, there's an ambulance Unfortunately, back. we're going to have to back off so and come back another time when there are less filthy immigrants. Oh, these filthy immigrants, how could Come they on, take all our homes and all our jobs in the outpost? Look at that filthy immigrant jumping up and down on that car. I bet oh. the proud British man that owns that car has been very upset by this. Filthy immigrants are repelled by the proud British underground rail. Unfortunately, we have been driven underground. It seems Too that the immigrants... immigrants seems that the immigrants have a bigger threshold on this country than I originally thought. It seems that the immigrants have turned off the power to hinder our progress, but this will not waver us from Hang finding on. them and kicking them out of our guys, country. Guys. It looks like all these immigrants have done the work for us. They will be greatly respected, however, their courses will be shipped out of our country. I don't like the sound of... Oh, behind you! I will shank you! But it's time to kill this immigrant. Fuck off. Filthy immigrant has been destroyed. Little wanker. It is truly a sad day when a white man has to be driven underground because immigrants have taken his country. <sighs> mm. This is why you need to vote for UKEEP to keep these immigrants out of our country and bring back our uh, glorious uh, British heritage. Oh, those filthy, greasy idiots. Just fuck off. Let us return to the surface. Where Michael Farage is waiting for us to anally, anally bum rape us. Let's head back to the proud British community of Lakeside. There are no supplies down here, so let's make this quick. We are in the safe zone. We are now safe. We have finally returned back to the great British civilization, and we will uh, we will prepare for more immigrant seeking. Well, let's go and steal and stash our ah, stolen that. <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> Let us go and sell our confiscated immigrant items. It's been a hard day of immigrant finding and kicking out of our country. I think we ought to go down to pub, have a few pints, uh, shoot some pool and uh, smoke in front of the cameras because we are just local British blokes. Do yeah. you not agree, fellow British blokes? Oh, I definitely agree. Oh, I certainly agree, Sonny Jim. I think we've made the country a better place now that the world, now that it is slightly more rid of these filthy immigrants. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. And be sure to vote for you keep to keep these immigrants out of our country and make it a better place. Goodbye. Goodbye. Oh, God, water. <laughs> I feel so dirty doing this. <laughs> it just feels so wrong. I firmly believe that the immigrants are the cause of my very low frame rate. Using up all our bandwidth. The immigrants must have built your graphics card then. <laughs> the poor quality parts not made in Britain. We can't go the other way because there is a lot of supplies. Wait, I had... Oh, you went round. Oh my god, Ben. I couldn't see it. I have found some supplies. Uh, anybody want a crowbar? Yeah, I'll take the crowbar. I've got a katana. <laughs> a guitar? Katana. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> As we have discussed before, that when we go into a state of a coma, it is caused by black people. Uh. Okay. <laughs> okay. I do not understand that, but fine. Mate, I don't mate, understand. Mate, you shit, mate. <laughs> you shit, mate. I don't like... Where are you going, my fellow immigrants? Immigrants? Oh. Immigrants? I'm an immigrant? What the fuck is that? You're an immigrant now. Ah! Uh, we must gut ourselves on our swords. <laughs> oh god, there's an invisible wall and I'm... Yeah, we have become that which we most wish to purge. Although not really. Some British made supplies of... What the fuck is this? What? What did you find? What the f- Is what? that you? 
We can walk. Uh, I can hear gunshots. <laughs> <laughs>